Genocide. Stop supporting genocide. Do not incite the war for the world. 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 Do not incite Police are here because the speaker is coming into his office uh -huh. and didn't want him to confront the people, right? Yeah. And the people are here to say, no BB, meaning BB Netanyahu, in DC, meaning our city. And we think that there is a place for BB, and that is in Ahe. They should be arresting BB, not us. They've murdered so far 23 members of my extended family in Gaza. 23, youngest one, seven years old, oldest one, 82 years old, <laughs> the whole range, the whole lifetime, not to mention one of my aunts right now, very sick, can't get medicine, because there is a blockade on any kind of aid coming in, 23 members, this is mentioning just Gaza let alone in the south of Lebanon, I have other cousins there who have had to vacate their homes entirely. Memories, places where they cook breakfast, places just hanging out, gone, all gone. These people are all complicit in genocide, every single one of them, and we need to stop it. Netanyahu should not be invited because he is a war criminal. He has committed war crimes. Um, he's unapologetic about it. And for so long, he's been given impunity by not only the United States, but other countries as well. And he should not be invited here. And if he comes, he should be arrested. And I would note, if in 2015 it was controversial for Netanyahu to come here, it sure as heck is controversial for him to be coming here in 2024 in the midst of a genocide. It's unacceptable. I don't think Netanyahu should be invited. I'm ashamed that Democrats and Republicans weren't outraged and spoken out against him coming. This is like having Hitler come and speak. This is asking a genocidal person to come and speak before Congress. He is a part of the genocide of 32,000 people already. The complicity of the United States is already established. And then for the Speaker of the House to invite him to come and talk to the House about how much more they can be complicit in genocide is just outrageous. If there is one person, one congressperson that actually goes to that meeting, they ought to be censured by the people.